It's Pranza and the procession. Um, it's a beautiful uh, thing. It's a victory, the triumph of uh, Jesus entering the Jerusalem, riding the donkey. Um, look how beautiful it is. Now climbing up through the Mount of Olives. Actually, it's a Mount of Olives, uh, but we are climbing to the top of it, and then we will continue down to the um, uh, to the city, to Jerusalem. And I wanted to meet Ori. Ori is a very good friend of mine. And he's a YouTuber just like me, but in a way better. And uh, I will be happy if you will subscribe his uh, channel too. I will send you the link at the description of Ori. It's worth it because he's, he's only four, 15 now, 15 years old. Um, I'm honoring that Jerusalem cross to James O'Neill from Washington, D.C. Uh, if you want to have your own cross or uh, or a Bible, don't hesitate. Add it to my YouTube channel. Uh, Add it to uh, buy me a coffee link, which is at the description, and you will know exactly how to do that. You will get, you will have a video of yourself. You will get the, the cross to your house. Then everything will be beautiful. I'm so happy to do that. Excellent weather. I'm going backward, I hope that everything will be okay. Uh, you can see the palm branches that mentioned in the book of uh, um, John. We just went out from Bedfadi, Bedfadge, and uh, that's where he um, started the tour into Jerusalem as a Messiah, as Son of God. And uh, this, is, this, is, this is amazing. Uh, it's the beginning of the Holy Week. Sunday. Well, not a lot of tourists today at this time because of the situation, but uh, it's still amazing, it's still beautiful. Itamar is here too, Moses' nephew. Remember him? What are the two Muslims people are doing with the sticks? Um, until 18, uh, 18, 80 something like that. Um, the Muslims, uh, the Christians, and the Jews have to pay a lot of money to survive in the city for the Muslims. Oh, now we can hear it. Uh, and sorry, they have to pay a lot of money to survive. Then the one who paid money had kind of um, security soldiers. And although now it's of course not exist anymore, 
you can uh, you can see that traditionally that we do it. Where we are climbing up through the top of of um, Mount of Olives to the Ascension Place, to the area of the Ascension Place, to the place that uh, Jesus told the disciples uh, the prayer, the Lord's Prayer, and from there we will we'll go all the way down to the Kidron Valley. Look how beautiful it is. <clears throat> And we will enter to the city. We will visit Garden of Gethsemane, uh, Dominus Flavi, the Lord Wept Church. So many, so many places. And look how many people are walking with us today. James, James O'Neill, we are still walking with you. Let's see what uh, they actually see. They're still climbing up. Oh, how, what amazing weather we have today. I think last month, uh, last year it was in April. And it was quite hard if I remember correctly. This is East Jerusalem. Most of the people here are Palestinians, Arabs. Most of them are Muslims. There's only 2% of Christians in the, in the city. In the, actually in the city as well. Soon you will hear the Oshana, Hosanna, Hosanna, Gloria. Don't, don't actually stop that video. Continue with us until the end. While doing it, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Be part of my family. I do have more than 20,000 videos of the Holy Land. It's worth it. You can ask me whatever you want. And if I'm talking about the view, let me let me show you the view of wow 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 this is east mount of olives and there you can see Herodion it looks like a shape of a volcano mount this is not less than the forest that King Herod built and his tomb is there yes his tomb is there and if you're talking about that behind that that um, uh, that small hill, it's Bethlehem. The nativity church, the place that Jesus was born, is there too. Israel. Oops. Sorry, 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 sorry. You don't want to disturb them. Most of the chanting is in Arabic. Most, let's say 90% of the Christians in Israel are Arabs. Then the main language is Arabic, not Aramite, not Hebrew, not English. In front of you, you can see a beautiful monastery. <clears throat> this is Paternoster Church and Monastery or Aluana. When the, um, St. Ellen came to here, she built three churches in, uh, in that area. One of them you already know, this is the Church 
of the Holy Sepulchre. The second church is uh, the Nativity Church, and the third church, which is less known, I must say almost unknown, is Aloana. And according to what we believed, that's where the disciples study everything. And the master himself, the rabbi himself, the Lord himself, was Jesus Christ. Amazing place. Beautiful church belongs to the um, French Catholic. You can hear the church is welcome, welcome us with the bells. Nah, they just stopped it. Today it belongs to the Carmelite order. Ah, yes, can you hear the bells? You can see that there's a lot of uh, police here. A lot of police here to protect everyone. It's a very sensitive uh, time here. Then it's good to know that we are protected by by them. Uh, this is Olivier. Olivier is the nicest monk ever. Yeah. We are reaching now. Ah, I was looking for you. I was looking for you. <laughs> I'm fine. Another amazing YouTuber. YouTuber. Yes, she, I met you. Uh, so I was looking for her. I, I will stay here a little bit. I want you to see the crowd, to hear the happiness. Sure that you can understand it if everything is in Arabic. No, <laughs> we never rest. I hear. <laughs> no, I, this is my energy. This is my battery. This is a reason to live. <laughs> Thank you.
Are you smiling like me? Mount of Olives. Behind Mount Olive Bazaar, it's the Ascension Church. That's where Jesus ascended into heaven and promised us to come back again. To the left, you can see the wall of uh, Aluana Church, Pater Nuster Church. A father, the father, a father praying, the Lord's Prayer. Lots of wind, lots of wind. Sorry about the noise. Uh, you can see how beautiful is Jerusalem there. Uh, the procession is on the way. I'm moving to the other side uh, to take a video from the other side of the road because it's going to be beautiful. It's going to be a mixture of um, uh, Jerusalem and the procession. Remember, this is Ori. Hey, Ori. And Ori's father. Ah, such an amazing uh, child, I must say. Although it's windy and even my rain, I mean, I want you to see how beautiful it is.
horrible of you to do that. that YouTube uh, Veronique Veronica
the few, they have to speak, they have to say something about it. I'm freezing! <laughs> you can see how beautiful Jerusalem here. The city of David is right there. Mount Zion, then the room of the Last Supper. It will be, he will be there soon. Garden of Gethsemane, down the valley. He's gonna be there on um, Thursday. We're getting closer to Dominus Flavi, the Lord of Act. On the way you will see, you can see the biggest and the most important Jewish cemetery uh, from the time of King David until now. Let me show you a little bit of it and of course the Dome of the Rock, the temple. Dominus Flavi is where Jesus um, stopped while he was riding the donkey and look at Jerusalem and wept and he said one day that city will be destroyed and by that he meant the temple as well then Dominus Flavid, the Lord wept church I took a video of it early morning but this time we are not entering the church it's going to be closed The church is open, but we are not going in this, this time. and on the way to Garden of Gethsemane. I took a video of it today, according to the book of, uh, to the Gospel of John. It's a totally different story. It's a beautiful story. Story of an amazing person, an amazing God, an amazing son of God. Then watch it. It will be on YouTube soon. I took a small shortcut because I wanted you to see Garden of Gethsemane together with the procession but listen to the bells. And look at the facade of Garden of Gethsemane, Gethsemane Church.
until the procession will come, I want you to see the tomb of Mary, the mother of Jesus, according to according to the Armenian and the Orthodox, the Greek Orthodox, and actually the rest of the Orthodox churches. Let's wait for the procession to come.
Let's climb up. Let's enter to the city together with Jesus, together with the disciples, together with so many people who came to here this year. According to Orthodox tradition, this is where St. Stephen was stoned. Uh, James, although I don't have voice anymore from singing, I'm still honoring uh, that tour to you, but to everyone who are watching that video. more and more people are still entering the city together with us. Look at beautiful this Mount of Olives. The procession will enter now to uh, the city through the Lion's Gate. The Lion's Gate will take you to the Via Dolorosa, St. Anna Church, Bethesda Pools, and of course the Church of the Holy Sepulchre.
Another 10 minutes, I want you to see a beautiful place.
Welcome to the old city. Welcome to the old city of Jerusalem. Good luck. Now we can hear me. Rice. And Jacob is behind me. I'm happy.
The guys, we reach St. Anne Church. This is where Mary was born. And the Casta Pools are here too. Remember, 38 years of a person, handicapped person, who couldn't enter to the pool. Let me show it to you, and that's going to be the end of the video. If you're rich, one hour and eight minutes, it means that you are a saint. Then please write something and don't forget to subscribe my channel. And James O'Neill, thank you very much for supporting me. And I will send you the cross next week. This is the amazing church of St. Anne, Crusader Church. Uh, and at the grotto you can visit the house of Mary. But I want to show you the pools. And that's, that's going to be the end of the video for today. Then wait with me another minute. One minute and you will see. This is the pool itself. Think about that poor man that couldn't enter to the pool to be cured by the wave of the pools. But then Jesus came on Saturday and cured him. Um, thank you very much for being with me in this amazing uh, hour and happy Easter to everyone. See you.